What's up my people? Welcome to another cars video. Today we will be reviewing my custom Bath Lightning McQueen based on Dirt Mouth Dirt Mouth Lightning McQueen. No, not Dirt Mouth. Bug Mouth Lightning McQueen. So, as everybody knows where I get most of my new cars from, my teacher. My car the cars I get are a little chipped up and this one was chipped up a lot. So, I decided <gasps> What if I take another red and, no, what if I take something red and paint them and paint it over? But then once I started painting it, I thought, what if, what if, if Lady McQueen wants to take a bath? So I took some pink lip, lip gloss or makeup, pink lip gloss or makeup, and I painted him. Because he, because McQueen needs a wash, you know, after all that. And as you can see behind you, you can see another Lightning McQueen that's all red and pretty cool. He's not taking a bath anymore. And Jackson Storm is not in this video, but he will be as when we take a comparison and talk about the fatness that McQueen has lost. Really. Was I in the camera for a second? I don't know, guys. So, my sister's in the bathroom, unfortunately, and I decided, why not record this video now? I can't record a video in school, because my classmates will be a lot more annoying. There's no way I can do it. So, anyways, since I have made this custom, I uh, made this out of Dirt Mouth Lightning McQueen, but unfortunately, without internet, I do not know how Dirt Mouth Lightning McQueen was released. But tomorrow, during school, when I post this video, I don't know what time. I think recess, no, recess, lunch. Yeah, I'm pretty sure either le recess or lunch, I'm going to look it up and tell you guys in the description. So, on my video yesterday about Chick Hicks, Dynaco Chick Hicks, if you guys saw, I, if you guys saw an arrow, I told you guys releases I found on the computer. I mean, not the computer. The internet. And, yeah. So, that's that. Now, what other thing was I talking about? Or was? Um, let me think. Yeah, releases for this guy. So, guys, since I custom made this guy, guess what? I get to come up with my own releases. So, for appearance, Lightning McQueen with dirt, I mean, with bugs in his mouth, did appear when McQueen and Sally are taking that drive. So, since this, I based, I based this car off of Bug Mouth Lightning McQueen, you have to mention the real thing. So, he appeared there, and I'm pretty sure Bug Mouth Lightning McQueen was released as a single. And I'm pretty sure in the, um, my god. Sorry, as I guys still do. My sister's in here, and she just got soap on her hands. Ooh, I don't want to touch it. Even though I, my grandma, even though my grandma yesterday kind of didn't make, only gave me two pieces of chicken and three pizzas. By three pizzas, I mean like little oven pizzas, because everything else I didn't like, because she knows that. So for Lightning McQueen with, uh... Lightning McQueen, you know what, you know what I'm going to call this car? I'm going to call him Bath Lightning McQueen. So Bath Lightning McQueen was originally released in the Radiator Springs Classic Series at uh, Toys R Us in 2008 as a single. <laughs> what? Ari, I'm coming up with these. It's not real. Sorry guys, but since my sister's in here, I guess we'll still be making noises. Pause. You guys get it? Pause. Okay, stop. So he was also he was also released in 2010 or 9 in the final lap collection. If you guys are like, what? Guys, I'm going to tell you one more time. These are custom releases, okay? So for the next couple of releases, I would tell I tell you guys are fake. So he got so, he was also released in 2012 in the Kmart Collector's Day with rubber tires, unfortunately, and weird. He also got a release in 2015, again in the Radiator Springs Classic Series, 
with Sally and Red. It was a three pack. Because obviously he got sprayed by Red, so he was basically taking a bath with water. And then he was released in 2017 in another, well not really series, he was he was released in 2017 again with lenticular eyes in the in the Radiator Spin Classic series again. And with a lot of Toys R Us stores are closing now. May this is a little thing. He may be released in the 2018 Radiator Springs Classic line again, but this time with a stick out tongue. No, I'm just kidding. He's getting in 2018, Toys R Us is thinking about releasing this Lightning McQueen with a red that sprays out fake water. And McQueen, you tap McQueen's top and he says, what was that for? And he screams because water being pushed down on him. So for my custom appearance, when Sally, I mean when Luigi and Guido give McQueen that offer, McQueen, I think, got it or talked or whatever. And then as soon as, <coughs> bless you, and as soon as uh, Luigi and Guido leave, Red and Sally sneak up on McQueen from the front. It's amazing that McQueen didn't see them. And Red sprays McQueen, even though McQueen was clean. Like this. Not pink. But this was pretty cool, you know, after getting bugs in his mouth, he decides to clean himself up. You know, take a bath. Oh my god, Ari, I don't know. I don't care. Stop getting your crap on the camera. Jeez. Oh, okay. So, I guess we can review him now. So on the top, you can just see a faint R. So he has, like... Everything's for her in the stupid bathroom. Bubbles and stuff. It's like the... What I used when I was looking at this, I thought some of this could be bubbles. Because, guys, there's a little bit of red on him, as you can see. Then you got the eyes and the mouth. What's that black thing? Oh, it's just a scratch. Because I told... Because, like I said, you guys, these this car was scratched up badly. So, then you have this. The Lightyear tires are not, are not pink, even though they should be. Because McQueen had a bath, and he's using his hand. So, he has to take the soap and... Rub it around his body. But since he's a car, he can't get his tire or his hand and just go out the back of a spoiler and then say, Uh, yeah. Nope, he cannot do that. So on the side, you can see faint, you can see a faint 95 and a bolt and some of the Piston Cup logos. They got the same thing in the game as well. You know what, guys? Can you see the sponsors? They're so faint. But you can see Leakless. Right here. Let me show you guys from the Cars video game. So anyways guys, I got it set up. Wait, let me get closer to the screen. I can care less. See? Piston Cup Nitro Aid Mood Springs. Also in the game, they look very faint and printed. Not to mention that's the same on the die cast. On the diecast itself, the sponsors are very faint. Do you guys think I should go? I'm gonna go. Oh, 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 I'm gonna run into that pole right there. Ow! Whoops. Give me a second, guys. Oh. Hey, guys, wanna see something cool? Look. Baby Lightning McQueen! Whoop. Uh oh. I see him off the track. Uh, okay, guys. Oh my god, no. Hey, drifting on him. Um, look at this, guys. I didn't even know you could do this in the game. Oh, look at McQueen's ugly smile. He's like, oh yeah. Why can't I do it anymore? I'll be right back. So, you guys think my driving is terrible or good? By the way, guys, I was playing the car's demo, not the actual game. Because my brother has an Xbox, but I was playing on my sister's Xbox because, you know, big screen. But it's pretty cool that as McQueen, you can just press A and turn really hard and you can just go drift in. 
around it. But anyways, guys, yeah. It's A and turn, and then you drift like that. It takes special skill. So on the die cast, yeah, the sponsors are pretty faint. But with the Cars 3 Lightning McQueen, they're not really that... They're not, like, printing. Like, so tiny. I mean, you could see them. You could see Vitaline for older active cars. But the decals were just, like, so... Just so faint. Like the die... Like the sponsors. Like, you see Piston Cup right here? It was like that, but it was like... You couldn't, like, really read Piston Cups that easily. And on the back... Since McQueen doesn't really get washed in the back, he still has his rookie stripes, Rusty's. Now, on this die cast, Rusty's is not written on the spoiler. As you guys can see in the red, he, he did not have the Rusty's logo. On the top, you can see a faint 95. Can you guys see that? I guess you guys can see that. And that, and here's the other side. See what I'm talking about, guys? The sponsors are kind of, like, faint. I can see RPM, my favorite. And now it's time for a die cast comparison between the Cars 1 and Cars 3 McQueen. Now the Cars 1 Lightning McQueen is actually a different model from the Cars 3 Lightning McQueen. Surprising, right? Well, it is. You can see McQueen has pretty... Th McQueen's pretty thin, and then he's pretty fat. Not to mention that McQueen lost weight. Why are his headlights... For Cars 1, his headlights were, like, right up here. And then for Cars 3, his headlights go down a little. So, a little weird. A little unobvious. Now, my brother... Damn! I want to show everybody your tattoos, dude. No. Come on. Please. Let me see. Damn, he did a pretty good job. Ooh, what'd you write? Let me see. If I have a dream that one day this is, this, this. Nation. I have a dream that one day this nation will rise up and line out and live out the meaning of its creed. Let me read this a quote one. from Dr. Martin Luther King. And this one says, a true relationship is two unperfect people refusing to give up on each other. Then here, I drew an S with a halo going through it. Like Jackson, I hate you. I drew the American flag and my name. Mm hmm. Drew a WWE sign. Then I drew a heart that says amazing with another sign. Then I drew a cube. You better hope we you better hope you can erase that erase that before dad sees because when decals are so faint you can kinda see it. So you better hope. So yeah, guys, that's pretty much it for this video. Hey, if you're going to do that, get out. Okay, I have to talk loudly. So anyways, guys, thank you for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. And what do you guys think of my driving? Do I drive for ah. Ari, stop. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And bye.